Hello everyone, and as the title of this video may have suggested, yes, I am going to be leaving YouTube and I'm going to be switching completely over to Twitch. Uh, if you're interested in joining me over there, I will have links down in the description and in the comments uh, over to, uh, to take you over to my Twitch page. Uh, and the you know even, I, I realize that a lot of people are used to watching the videos sort of just whenever they want to, and that will still be available in the form of video on demand over on Twitch. But you should know that the videos on demand only last for about two weeks before Twitch uh, by by necessity has to uh, delete them, and so just a heads up for those of you who are regular viewers of mine. Um, if you are not able to catch my streams, the videos on demand will still be over on Twitch for a while. But um, I have decided that I am no longer going to be doing YouTube videos. And I have many reasons for this. Uh, one of the primary uh, reasons for this is I really don't need to anymore. Um, when I first got into YouTube, uh, I did it because I wanted an alternate source of, uh, of, of, of income and I wanted to be able to have a job that I actually loved. Um, and, and just to be clear, I still do really enjoy making videos and I still enjoy playing video games for you guys. Um, that part of it's un uh, unchanged. Uh, I still enjoy that. The problem has become uh, in large part YouTube and in large part because of me. Um, uh, let's start with YouTube. Um, when I first got into YouTube about seven and a half years ago or so thereabouts, um, it was a different place. Um, <laughs> For, for one, they were paying their content creators more. Uh, for two, bless you, Diamond. Uh, for two, the, the rules and restrictions that they had weren't quite as stringent. And bless you, goodness, you had, got the sneezes today, my dog. <laughs> um, and... Uh, there has been a lot of additions, a lot of very careful things we've had to do, uh, those of us who are content creators, in order to be able to keep our channels. Um, and most of those restrictions really weren't affecting me much in terms of like my content, but it did affect quite a bit in terms of my uh, in terms of my uh, income regarding this and also in, in terms of my viewership. Um, those of you who have been part of my channel from the beginning or have been with me for a long time, you may have noticed that I had a big increase in my, in my viewers, in my subscriptions, in all that difference. I had a huge increase for the first few years. And then over the last uh, maybe three or four, about three, the last three, uh, they, it has died off completely. Uh, I get a very, very, very slow trickle of new subscribers and my view count has gone down considerably. Uh, this is almost entirely due to the fact that I uh, do not go by this algorithm that YouTube insists upon doing. Uh, YouTube does have an algorithm, and if you don't follow that algorithm, you are doomed to obscurity. And that's pretty much what happened to me. Uh, personally, I find uh, that people who manipulate the algorithm are usually very slimy. Um, and the ones that aren't slimy and are actually creating quality content are still have, they're basically being forced into following that algorithm in order to continue having their channels be successful. And I just don't, I, I just, I don't, number one, I, like I said, I think have the, all the people that have to do 
algorithm chasing. It's ridiculous. There's no reason for that. Why the hell do we have uh, uh, do, do we have to have an algorithm? Well, I do know the reason why, and I don't want to get too much into it. Uh, but the bottom line is, it has a lot to do with YouTube is owned by Google, and Google has a an an overarching uh, political and aspirational set of policies uh, where they are very willing to uh, boost some people with some opinions and other people with opinions that they don't like, they do not boost them. And oftentimes they outright ban and uh, block and ban the videos and even the channels for daring to say the wrong words and daring to have the wrong opinions. Now, for the most part, they have been called out on that and they don't do it quite as much anymore, but it is still there. And expect every time we, uh, we start having uh, a, another president uh, or another congressman being voted in, expect that to start flaring its, uh, flaring its ugly head once again. Um, that's part of it. Um, the other part of it is YouTube simply does not care about small time creators like me. They just don't. Uh, and that's just truth. That's not, that's not bitter, you know, that, that's not bitterness. That's not, you know, me being soured on it. It's a fact of life. It's a fact of YouTube, uh, that the only way you can succeed in YouTube is having the correct political inclinations, the uh, uh, do follow the algorithm which uh, which YouTube ensures their biggest whales uh, that it makes certain they have that algorithm so that their biggest whales can continue to make them plenty of money and they leave that completely out of people like me uh, you know they don't tell people like me I'm small time they, I, I don't make YouTube hardly any money at all but those big whales, oh hell yeah! You think that uh, you think all those all those people who have two hundred fifty thousand and more subscribers, you think it's because they're they're popular and because they're you know they're so entertaining? In some part, yes. In most part, no. For the most part, because uh, I, I, I I watch a, a great deal of YouTube content, and for the most part, it's kind of crap. Uh, I mean, let's, let's just call it what it is. Most of the content that you see on YouTube is crap. It's, it's absolutely terrible. Um, you, you've got these, these YouTubers on there either acting like complete idiots or acting in bizarre random fashion, and that is to get people's attention so they're gonna, uh, their viewers are going to be like, oh, what are they going to do next? And that's, that's how they capture these guys. Is they do uh, they do the unexpected so that, or the 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 weird and bizarre so that people go ah ha 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 whoa what's that crazy person gonna do next, or they have the uh, the the correct political leanings and they're and they're more than willing to tell them on YouTube, and because of that, you know I, I, number one my p political leanings are my own business. And I have said from the beginning that this, you know, this channel is about gaming, not about politics, not about religion, not about any of those hotbed topics that I have prevented uh, uh, from being discussed on here since day one. Um, am I perfect at that? Have I done it in the past? Yeah. Uh, I mean, I'm, everybody's guilty of getting upset about things. Uh, but... Yeah, I mean, hey, have I done it? Yeah, of course I have. And I've deleted a large portion of it, believe me. And what little is left, uh, I just either I didn't catch or, uh, or, or I felt it was important enough to stay. But YouTube really has kind of soured itself uh, for me. And it's, there's, there's just so many unscrupulous things that YouTube and their big whale content creators are willing and able to do in order to maintain their fame and their profits. And I'm just not that guy. Uh, I, I, I believe I, I am for those of you who don't know, I, I'm a, I'm a retired U S army sergeant. 
I put 20 years of my life towards the freedoms of this uh, of of the United States and also the freedoms and independence of other countries as well. And I I don't believe that Google or YouTube and by extension YouTube since Google owns them have that same thought process. I simply don't. Um, whether it's true or not, I don't know. And, you know, I'm, you know, don't, don't take me to court because of my opinion, because you really, I mean, you can't, I'm not, I'm saying this is my opinion and therefore it is not slander. I'm allowed to say my opinion. I'm in the, I'm a U.S. American. Isn't that wonderful? Uh, which means I can say my opinion all I want, but I cannot claim fact. And are these things facts? I don't know, but in my opinion, they're as solid as concrete. And I have seen too much of the nonsense, the YouTube nonsense uh, that other content creators have done and coming from the lips of YouTube people themselves. And I just don't want to, I just don't want to do that anymore. I just don't want to have anything to do with YouTube. Uh, in that regard. Also, the other thing, uh, of course, and I've, and I've to uh, said things about this in the past. Their copyright laws and copyright things are so ridiculous, they're absurd. Um, and you may have noticed, and I'm sure a lot of you have, that so many content creators out there are clearly playing music that is copyrighted. I mean, come on, if you hear it on the radio or you've ever heard it on the radio ever in existence, if it's ever been out there for the world to hear, it's got a copyright on it. Which is why most, the vast majority of YouTubers don't put uh, music on anymore because eventually they get hit with copyrights. But you may have noticed that there's an awful lot of the big whale YouTubers that still have that, uh, still have that music in their videos. Do you think they're doing it and uh, because they're just going to take the hit and not get paid? <laughs> no. Because every single one of those videos represents thousands of dollars going in their pocket, depending on the video and depending on the size of the YouTuber. So no, you're not going to convince me ever that they put on, uh, they're, they're putting, on, uh, putting this music onto their videos deliberately sacrificing the content of their, that video so that they can have this, this music. No. And if they're able to get away with it and still get paid, but I'm not, and I get, and I get copyrighted for a snippet, a, a, a three second snippet, believe it or not, I have been hit with a copyright claim for a three second snippet of music. But these uh, these big whales are able to put that on there, and y you're never going to convince me that they're not getting paid for it. I mean, one way or another, maybe it's true, maybe it's not, maybe they're doing that. Eh, yeah. No, I don't believe it. Not for a second. The amount of work that goes into making a YouTube video, and the amount of effort and amount of expense that it takes to to do something even like this even my small time thing you're not going to tell me they're doing videos for free i mean maybe like once a year they might you know for like some charity thing or something but you know even that even those th charity things they can write those off on their taxes why do you think they're doing the charity streams to begin with i mean come on but regardless um I'm really, even though it sounds like it, I'm really not bitter towards the whales on YouTube. I'm bitter towards YouTube for allowing the whales to do it. And not only allowing them to do it, but encouraging them to do it. To, to make side deals with those big whales and tell them, oh, don't worry about it. You're exempt. We'll just make sure we cover that up. Or more likely, they'll say, hey, we'll pay for any copyright issues 
uh, that might have to get sent over to there. Just keep making your content because you're you're our whales and you're making us money. Don't I I am one hundred percent confident in my opinion of that. Whether it's true or not, do I know factually? No, but it's true in my opinion, and I don't think uh, that's going to change anytime soon. So, yeah, um, copyright nonsense. Yeah, that's uh, that's a big mess. Um, the uh, another big issue I have with YouTube is their deliberate censoring of a large portion of content that. Uh, YouTubers have made, but YouTube and more specifically Google does not agree with. Those videos have been removed. Those channels have been deleted. Those users have been banned. And you can, <laughs> you, you, you know, YouTube can try to claim innocence all at once. All you have to do is go out to the internet and, and, and listen to the rants going on on forums by content creators that have been canned, that have had their hard work deleted, abused, and, and thrown to the, and whatever, having legal action taken against them, all because they had the wrong opinion, all because they put uh, videos out that YouTube claimed were, I don't know, f fill, in your, fill in your blank. You guys have seen all the stuff on that that have been out there. I mean, social media has become a political landmine, and if you don't have the correct uh, uh, the the correct opinions, you you you're risking stepping on those landmines, and they have no problem blowing your channel up or blowing your account up or silencing you somehow. It's happened many many times in the past. And it continues to, uh, uh, to happen here. They're just more subtle about it. Now they call it the algorithm. You know, oh, but that algorithm is, is intended to be able to improve our profits and be able to make the content open for bullshit. My opinion. My opinion. But bullshit. So, as for the... YouTube reasons, that pretty much covers the, uh, the majority of it. As for, uh, but, but there's other reasons why I am quitting YouTube as well, and those are personal reasons. Number one, you guys may have noticed that I've had, uh, for those on Discord, who, 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 on my Discord, if you've sort of been watching on my, my posts and such on Discord, I have a lot of health problems. Uh, both physical and mental. And I have been fighting those for years, so ever since I got back from the deployment. And they have only gotten worse through a variety of things. I'm not going to get into them. Um, honestly, it's it's it, it, it's not going to help you any to know. And, it you know, I, I, I honestly don't want to have... A bunch of comments saying, "Oh gosh, poor lion." You know, I'm not that guy. That's not what I'm. T uh, that's not why I tell people what's wrong with me. I'm not looking for the sympathy. I'm looking. I, I just want to make sure my fans understand. I'm looking out for you guys. You know, I, I want to be able to create the best content that I can. I want to be able to entertain you, but I can't do that if I am so exhausted be, uh, because I was not able to sleep the night before because of either PS, uh, PTSD nightmares or neck pains, that uh, neck flare-up that is so bad that sleep is not an option and they last for hours, sometimes even days. Um, and, and just uh, the, the, a lot of... Uh, there's, a, there's been a lot of medically difficult issues that have made doing something like this difficult. Um, and, and I specify YouTube because on stream, it's not so bad. Uh, when, I'm, when I'm streaming, yes, I'm being entertaining. Yes, I'm good. But when I'm, when I'm done streaming, I'm done. 
it's the YouTube part of it that takes hours upon hours upon hours of my life, not to mention all the uh, the copyright and other crap like that. And let's not, like I said, <laughs> um, but in terms of effort on my part, in terms of time sink and time expenditure and time away from try taking care of myself. Yeah. Uh, YouTube burns a lot of it. Um, for those who watch me on Twitch, uh, they've kind of seen me go from like, oh, I start at nine o'clock in the morning and I go until three, four, five o'clock. Yeah, that, no problem. Yeah, except that slowly as time went on, went from three, four, five o'clock to two o'clock to one o'clock and now 12 o'clock and sometimes even earlier than that. And uh, granted, partially that was for health reasons, but the most of the reason, <coughs> excuse me, <clears throat> most of the reasons was because I simply didn't have enough time. I, I would, to, to give you an idea, I would end my channel at 12 o'clock and I would finally be done with everything and the video would be uploaded, not processed, not completed, simply uploaded, edited, uh, formatted, rendered, and uploaded by eight. So, and, and we're talking, I mean, starting at when the stream is done, beginning, uh, beginning all that, what needs to be done and ending by eight o'clock at night. And that was every day. Cause for the longest time I was doing this for, uh, you know, I was doing two videos a day and I was, do, you know, and, and I wanted to, uh, to, to do that for you guys. Um, but as time went on, that just couldn't happen anymore. You know, if I ended, if I went long into two, three, four, five o'clock at night, I wouldn't sleep the, <laughs> that night in order to get it all done. Um, because it's, you know, in order for me to continue the next day, no, I just didn't have it. Now, the larger streamers, the larger people, they can hire people and they can say, whoop, okay, here's my, uh, here's the footage, do your thing. I don't have that. I don't have the money to do that. I don't, you know, I, I don't really know people I, 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 well enough to trust them to do that. I can't trust them with my content because I want to make sure that that content remains personal to me and not becomes this, ugh, some of the, some of the stuff on YouTube. Good God. Anyway, getting on, moving on. Um, the, the, the real, the, 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 the real effort and the real time sink that YouTube de demands in order for me to be able to be able to post videos it's so much larger than than you would think. And back when I was younger and didn't have uh, quite the the rough time that I have now, I could do that. Um, but especially when I was trying to make this a a, a you know a, a career rather than a hobby, uh, because of course you know those of you who know. Uh, uh, this used to be a, an effort to make it a career. It has since become a hobby. And I just don't have that kind of oomph anymore. Um, partially due to the fact I'm getting older. Um, partially due to the fact that I have mental and physical issues. And partially due to the fact that I don't really need that money anymore. I'm retired now. You know, I, I don't, you know, it's great having the money, but I don't need the money. And if I'm honest, the, you know, in, when it comes to <clears throat> the money making part of the squeaking lion channel, I make more money on YouTube than I ever do on Twitch. And, and I think that's the real reason why I have stuck with uh, YouTube for as long as I have is because my fan base on YouTube is five, time, five times larger than it is on Twitch. And I make a great deal more money on YouTube than I do on Twitch. 
And so, you know, it, it's hard to just sort of walk away from that kind of money. Uh, not that it's like vast and all encompassing and, oh, wow, I am so rich. No. <laughs> uh, um, uh, it, but it, it's still more, it, it's still letting go of a lot of money uh, for effort that I have put in. And so it, I don't do this lightly. I'm not taking my leaving YouTube lightly. Um, but just the reality is that I had to pick one or the other. I had to pick YouTube or Twitch, one or the other. I simply can't do both anymore. And with YouTube, there is a great deal more effort and a great deal less interaction between me and you. And I like that interaction. I, I like being able to talk with you guys and chat with you guys and you guys tell me thing you know, like, hey, Lion, did you know about XYZ on this game over here? And I'm like, oh, no kidding. I can, you know, I can chat with you guys. I can talk with you guys. I can BS with you guys. And even if I can't, you know, even for the people who can't make it to my stream, at least you can go to the videos on demand. You can still watch those at your leisure, however you want. And it's essentially the same thing that you're watching on YouTube anyway. Because for the last like year or so, or however long uh, uh, since I made that choice, I have been just taking the, the video or the stream video on demand. And I haven't been used, I used to chop those up and put them as episodic um, videos on YouTube. Now I just put the whole thing on there minus interruptions and minus anything that I think maybe I better delete. Uh, <laughs> uh, just things like that. And yeah, I mean, I'm sorry for those of you who like watching my channel on YouTube and you like the, the idea of being able to just sort of come back and watch at any time that you, uh, you know, at your leisure. And, Cause I do understand, you know, when you, the difference between watching YouTube and watching Twitch is that on Twitch, you're watching on my time on YouTube, you're watching on your time. And I get that. I mean, I, I do the same thing. I prefer watching YouTube because I can watch the videos at my leisure when I'm, when it's available for me. I mean, I get it. I totally get that, that thought process. Um, but there's an awful lot of people who prefer to watch live streaming. And if I'm honest, I prefer to do live streaming. Um, uh, uh, over the years, I've just come to realize that that's where I have the most interaction with my fans and where I, I just have more fun being able to, to interact with you guys while, while I play games. And since I am now finding myself uh, with the realization that I have to pick one or the other, I'm going to pick Twitch and I'm sorry for those of you on, on YouTube who you only watch me on YouTube and you just don't have any, uh, have any desire to switch over to Twitch. I understand that. Um, I am sorry to lose you as fans. Truly I am. Uh, you, when, when at the end of all of my videos and all of my streams, I say, you, you know, I appreciate every single one of you. Thank you for watching. I mean that. I mean that wholeheartedly. I mean that with my entire being. I appreciate you guys. I really do. And for reasons that I'm not going to get into here. It's somewhat selfish, but... <laughs> uh, and, and, you know, has a great deal to do with ego, but also has a great to deal to do with... It's nice to know I'm accepted. Um... I didn't have that for an awful long time. And so the fact that I have a lot of you out there doing that for me, it's appreciated. It really is. And um, so I hate to have to, to shut down my channel for YouTube. I really do. But 
the fact is I got to choose one or the other and YouTube has got immense numbers of problems and represents an enormous time sink and effort on my part. Um, oh, sorry, my nose is itchy. It's, it's allergy season. Um, but there is a bonus to this um, because I no longer have to stop early uh, on Twitch, on my Twitch streaming, in order to be able to get my videos on YouTube out uh, on time. That means, you know, I don't have to do that anymore. That means that my streaming on Twitch will be able to last longer. Uh, I'll be able to go longer. I'll be able to play longer. Um, and as a result, my streaming amount, the amount of time I spend on stream will be considerably larger now. Uh, and you'll be able to, you know, if you can't necessarily catch me on YouTube, um, you know, maybe you can still be able to catch me on Twitch when I'm live. And even if I'm not on live, as I mentioned before, the videos on demand are up for uh, about two weeks uh, afterwards. So, you know, maybe. Uh, and, and as a matter of fact, I'm thinking about, uh, I haven't made the decision fully yet, but I've been thinking about taking, uh, since I'm no longer having to balance two different channels now, um, I, I am thinking of upgrading my Twitch uh, channel uh, so that I, I don't know, I'm able to, I don't know, I'm spending more money on it so that you guys get more and I can have more than I can add into it. And I can put all of my focus on Twitch. So hopefully in the future we should be seeing my Twitch page improve. Um, how much of an improvement? I don't know. Um, as, I, as I mentioned, my health, uh, my health is failing. Even now I'm, I'm feeling tired. Um, I, I'm, exhaustion is a real problem with me. Um, my, you know, my, my physical well-being is affected. Um, and this is kind of, this is kind of hard for me to do. Um, I hate having to leave you guys. I really do. But I got to pick one or the other and I'm going with Twitch just for, for the sheer fact that it's less effort, it's less BS and it's more interactive. So, for all of you who have been loyal fans for all these years on YouTube, I hope you will join me over on Twitch. I truly do. And as I mentioned at the beginning, I will have links down in both the description and in the comments. And uh, I hope to see you there. I truly do. Uh, I would hate to, to, to leave you guys in the lurch. Um, and where, you know, is this channel, you know, is my YouTube channel just going away? No, uh, my YouTube channel will continue on. Um, it will, I will leave it up so that people can continue to watch my content, uh, whenever they want, um, until YouTube decides that it's defunct and, or, or violates one of their other future changes. God only knows. And they decide to shut it down, one or the other. I don't know. YouTube has become so ridiculous that I just, I'm so... So, thank you all for your years of fans, you know, of, of, of fandom. <laughs> uh, thank you for watching me. I, I really do appreciate every single one of you. And as I, as always... Everyone, always remember that anyone can be a mouse at Roars. And I've done my best to be that, that special someone that's a lion that squeaks. And I hope that you can be a lion that squeaks as well. If, you can't, if I don't see you over on Twitch, have a wonderful life. If I do see you over on Twitch... Oops. <laughs> Welcome. Uh, so I, I, I'm, I'm having a hard time wrapping this up. <laughs> Anyone can be a mouse that roars, but it takes someone special to be a lion that squeaks.
So embrace your inner lion and squeak on. Goodbye, YouTube.